Good morning, folks. Welcome to our viewing windows of our gorilla habitat. Uh, these are western lowland gorillas. There are two species and four <laughs> species of gorillas. Um, this is what is found in uh, managed care throughout the world. They are a little bit smaller than the mountain gorillas that are the most um, well known uh, as far as uh, wild gorillas go, the most well known. Um, with our group here at Bush Gardens, we have a male group. We have a bachelor group. So this handsome man that has his beautiful back to us, you can see all the silver, which most people are familiar with the word silver back, but sometimes it is assumed that it is a, a particular type of gorilla. All male gorillas will eventually be silver. Um, it's a sign of maturity. It's, you look at it like when young men start to grow beard, then you know, they're, they're maturing physically. And so Bolingo has that beautiful silver it does extend down his legs a little bit on his belly. Um, gorillas do have a very large belly. A lot of times it is assumed that they're not at their optimal weight or they're carrying child, but it's perfectly normal. Uh, humans have 32 feet of intestines. Gorillas have 62 feet of intestines. So. Um, a lot going on in their digestion and very, very uh, complex. Um, they are herbivores. And they strictly eat in the wild, I would say most of the time, vegetation. They can supplement with fruits and seeds and some insects, but it's a very small percentage of their diet. So, Bolingo here, he is walking and around the window. Oh my God. Oh, what a ham! So, yeah, this is, this is what gorillas do. They relax. And uh, the sign back there is rolling down. Look at this. Something that he likes to do. There's one rolling down over here. Young gorillas. They, they, they wrestle, they giggle, they, 